Defensive change for the Rangers here in the bottom of the fourth. Scott Sheldon moves in behind the plate for Bill Hasselman. It's moving from behind the plate to first base, it'll be Scott Sheldon. Changes. Scott Sheldon moves the first base, moves over to second. Catalanano, who was the second, moves over to first. And they have just moved Scott Sheldon to shortstop. Kelly Bransfeld moves to second. We understand they're going to try to play Scott Sheldon in every position tonight. He's already played catcher first, second, now short. And there's Scott Sheldon moving around once again. He is now in right field. So he's been catching. He's been at first. He's been at second. He's been at short. Now in right field. But now another change. Scott Sheldon moves from right to left. Capital moves from center. I check that right to center. Kappa moves from center to right. And there's the new left fielder, Scott Sheldon. As you see, last player to play all nine positions. Cesar Tobar, Minnesota, September 22nd, 1968. Sheldon's caught, played first, second. Short, right, center, left. He's only got a couple to go. First pitch swing and line bullet. <laughs> played by Gransfeld right there. Throw was easy right over the top, and here comes Scott Sheldon right now. Right to the mound directly. Johnny Oates coming out. He must be a heck of a guy. The manager to let him do this. Look at that. 67 miles an hour. And that just goes to show you, you either got to be above the hitting speed. At 97, 98, 99, or 100, or get below it. Sheldon moving over to third base to finish off the nine positions since the fifth inning. 